It's the bee's knees. <gasps> it's the cat's meow. And I'm Judy Brownfield from Books at Sunset to share with you today a 100-year celebration for the Elgin National Road Race. <gasps> Sunday afternoon, August 8th, from 10 o'clock until 3, experience the turn of the century to celebrate these amazing old cars. We're going to have watermelon seed spitting. There will be three-legged races, ball and hoop and kids with cute clothes and jazz coming through the sunshine. We'll have music and dance and 50 cent, oh, no, could it even be 75 cent root beer floats, grandma's lemonade and fun for the kids and the family amongst those marvelous men and their magical machines. To make this magical afternoon possible, the City of Elgin, the Downtown Neighborhood Association, and of course, Sherman West Court, along with the Elgin Historical Society, will add flavor, panache, fun, and sparkle with jazz on this Sunday afternoon with the family. Great. Hi, Jeff. Steve Thorin here from the Fox Valley Model T Club of Elgin. We've really got an exciting event this year with the reenactment of the Elgin National Road Race, which is celebrating its 100-year anniversary. This year, it's going to be a huge event with more than just the old cars, but coupled with all the other items and activities that Judy Brownfield so wonderfully explained. But of course, the Fox Valley Model T Club's been putting this on for many years, but finally, the 100 year anniversary, we've actually got the original race car that won the last race in 1933 that will be back here on display for the event. We'll have the American Legion Color Guard headed by Don Sleeman to kick it all off, as well as Mayor Ed Schock. With all these other activities, all these wonderful cars, you need to come out and experience what life was like with the on the green portion 100 years ago. And of course the show is from 10 to 3 at a new location. 1950 Larkin Avenue at Sherman Westcourt, which is where the Blue Moon Ballroom used to be. At 3 o'clock is the spectacle. All the cars will line up and the Boy Scouts will do their color guard and release the cars. They were there 100 years ago and they're 100 years old too. Off we go for the parade lap to drive the race route that it actually was. That's Larkin Avenue west to Coombs, north to Highland, back east to McLean, and back to Larkin. Eight and a half miles. Make sure you come and experience the fun. August 8th, 10 o'clock to 3. Join us! 